And Fresno City Council member Luis Chavez is proposing an emergency order that would halt indoor operations at stores in the city for at least five days. It's triggered when ICU availability drops to zero. But as CBS 47 Shauna Kalafi explains, there could be some changes to the proposal before it comes to a vote. If it's enacted, this order would stop businesses from letting people indoors for at least five days, but it could be extended even longer than that. Now, this proposal has already come with a lot of criticism from at least three of the other council members, but now working with the Fresno Chamber as well as the Health Department to change some of the language in that proposal and make it more appealing to businesses as well as city leaders. As it stands now, the emergency order proposed by Fresno Council Member Luis Chavez would halt indoor operations at stores in the city once ICU availability drops to zero. But now he's working with other departments to adjust the language of that proposal. Chavez had a video meeting with almost 30 Fresno business owners on Tuesday, and they had some ideas of their own. Uh, maybe uh, limiting even more the number of people that can actually go into the uh, store uh, at once. And, and, and then also they came to the table with uh, perhaps some more um, sanitation uh, procedures that they could implement more often. Chavez says those are some alternatives they're considering, but for small businesses only, since they don't have the same capabilities as big chain stores. Uh, let's be honest, uh, big box stores are going to be okay. They have, they have apps that allow people to order from home uh, and then just, you know, go to a designated parking spot and just pick up their groceries. But a lot of our small businesses do not. Another concern that came up during his meeting with business owners was the possibility that if stores in Fresno shut down, customers would take their business to nearby cities like Clovis. Chavez says that is a valid point and an added reason why they're considering special rules for small businesses or even making them exempt from the order altogether. What I think we'll end up with is on not, um, you know, completely shutting down uh, businesses uh, and then also uh, perhaps working on having uh, folks that can work from home work from home, for example, um, offices. And Chavez says he hopes to have this draft ready by the middle of next week and it would need a five out of seven vote from the council members to pass. Reporting from Fresno City Hall, Shauna Kalafi, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.